If I just, like, hang by these guys, he'll eventually come by and attack us. Or... Yup, no, that's exactly what I needed to happen. He just pissed everything. Ooh, what is this? Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to Ark, where today is the day. We go and fight the Manticore. And, of course, I am going to be using my Wyvern army here that we just got done taming up. Um, but first off, I do got to go over some stuff here regarding the future of the channel. So if you guys would like to skip this part, I'm going to have a timestamp up on the screen now. So yeah, you guys can just skip there if you want to go see the Manticore fight. Um, but yeah, I'm going to continue now with the, the future of this channel. So from here, from here on out, we are going to be cutting back on the amount of shorts I am putting out. Um, I It has recently come to my attention that a lot of the shorts I am putting out are just random, just random nonsense that really doesn't need to be a short. And I think I could also get more, it'd be more beneficial for me to also focus in on getting more entertaining moments. Like uh, moments in the game where I'm struggling or I'm try like trying to steal like a wyvern egg. You know, cut it down to more like that stuff. And uh, you may have noticed things like last episode... I really didn't feel like there was anything in there worth a short, so I didn't even bother. And I feel like that's something I need to more or less try now is to not do a short. And if I do find something that I feel like is short worthy, I mark it down and like so that way I know to go back and get that for the short, you know. Um, otherwise, it's it. Because originally I was like looking at it, it's like, all right, I need to get two shorts from this one video. And it's like, I'm just running around my base breeding creatures. Like, what am I supposed to get shorts of that? Like, it's boring. And of course, yeah, I do get a good one where it's like, ooh, look, a mutated baby. But like, if I have one, like three or four of those videos in one week, it kind of dilutes the value of them, I feel. Um, so, yeah, we're going to be cutting back on shorts. Um... And as well, I have been feeling some burnout here recently in ARC. So I'm, like, after today, after episode 70, we are going to take a break. Um, we are, it's going to be about two weeks, and we're just going to take a break from ARC. Of course, I'm going to continue posting Gears of War, and we're going to hopefully finish Gears 3 here. That's what I'm looking for. I don't think we're going to do Gears 4 or 5. We're definitely not going to do 5. That thing's trash. Um, Gears 4 is kind of, eh, it's meh, it, it's, it's mid-tier, but, yeah. So we're gonna hopefully finish Gears of War here, um, and then after two weeks here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kind of still think on, like, video ideas for, uh, after the two weeks, and we're just gonna come back for a week, record some videos, then we're gonna wait until the center comes out, and then I'll post videos a week before the center drops. You know, just so that way we can get ready for the center and all that. Kind of get a refresher of what's going on. Um, but I am thinking of other series to take its place. But again, here the next two weeks, it's just going to be Gears of War. And I, I know that's that's really not the best performing videos I ever have. They're honestly the worst performing videos. I don't know why I'm doing them still. It's kind of more or less now I feel like I've committed to it. So I got to... I gotta keep on going. Um, but yeah, Gears of War continue. Um, what else was there? Oh yes, we are also going to be trying to focus more on uh, learning and editing in videos. I know I have said this in the past, but like this is something I really need to start doing. Um, like as you may have noticed, I said at the start of this video that there's going to be a timestamp to skip to for the Manticore. Um, well, that's one thing I'm going to try and start doing, like, when I have long, ex ex you know, explaining stuff long and, you know, taking up a lot of time before the actual thing like I am today. Like, I'm going to start adding those in. i um, going to do some more transitions, like fading and all that. Uh, but, yeah. Oh, I might also here take up some streaming. And, again, this is just going to be streaming on YouTube. And, uh, I've been thinking of some games. Um, I did just get done modding Fallout New Vegas for us to play. For me to play, personally. I don't know if I want to stream it, though, because, well, my mod 
pack doesn't seem to be working 100% right. I'm trying to fix it still. But then I've also got another option for a game I want to replay. And that's just because it's got, like, the third game technically in the series came out here recently. Um, and that's going to be the South Park Stick of Truth. And then we also got South Park's Fractured Butthole, which is the sequel. And then, what was it? Then it's South Park Snow Day, I believe is what it is. Is the third game. But yeah, uh, we might we might try and stream those. I don't know. Because again, those those are a little bit, little bit more explicit games where they do show some nudity in them. So I guess I have to mark them in a certain way on YouTube. They're definitely going to have to be marked as 18... 18 plus so yeah anyways it's been gun I wouldn't I what the hell am I doing I'm not gonna do my outro mm -hmm. alright let's go cut over to the manticore I can't believe I full-on run to go do my outro alrighty so we just got to drop all our cryopods off and then we should be ready to go can I not throw cryopods into a Okay, let's start, just do this. Cry. Boom. Boom. They're off me. Boom. Boom. And let's drop you, you, you. Um, we're going to eat three pieces of meat. <laughs> Got a nice little wyvern pile going on down there. It's honestly not the best situation down there. I'm pretty sure I'm going to have like three or four wyverns that might not teleport in with us. Um, I'm gonna bring Jeroboa with just because I can always replace him so not bringing much with me um worst case scenario why did you guys go in the inventory I need you guys to go in the tribute there we go worst case scenario is that they have changed this in a way which makes it so that way uh Wyverns can no longer go in. Let's do this. Ooh. I was just trying to back out of that. Where's my wyvern? Oh, yep, see what I mean by like, we're definitely going to have one or two that are going to not come in. Like, they're just poking out. There's really not much I can do. I think I'm going to hop on this lightning wyvern right here when we teleport. Lightning. No. Boom. If I just like hang by these guys, he'll eventually come by and attack us. Or... Yup, no, that's exactly what I needed to happen. He just pissed everything. Ooh, what is this? Oh, oh, this is the terminal. Grab it. Everything is finite. I uh, did I forget to get this when I was I might have forgot to get this back on the island. At least I think I did. Also, look at my wyvern army. They are shredding him. You know what? There's death worms. I probably shouldn't be landed. I can land up here. There's something damaging. Do I get damaged if I'm on the ground? Slowly ticking? It looks like I do. Alright. I got one problem with this wyvern. That I'm on. That is that it is built for killing. It was not built for riding. So that I have its stats uh, all different than what you would expect for a wyvern, you know? There's no... Where is that thing? It, oh, it's right on me. <laughs> oh, no, it's not. It was just one of my wyverns. It looked like it was right on me. I'm trying to help here, but like every time I get lined up for a shot, he moves. I gotta go find somewhere to land so I can regain stamina. Let's just do that right here. I see some like weird things on the ground I need to go check out. They're killing him. 
I think I gotta be pretty close though, just in case, cause like, it might not register that I've killed it. Or that, you know, well, it'll register that it's died, but it probably won't register that, like, I was a part of the process. That's why I'm trying to get a hit off on it every now and again with the wyvern, just so that way the game recognizes that I'm doing something. Also, I like as I'm sitting there, I just noticed that those two things rolled up on me. Those two little dots of dirt. Those there are death worms. Look at this swarm, my my guys. It is definitely ripping this dude apart pretty fast. What are we at? We're at like four minutes in total. I'm betting this is gonna Ooh, that is a rock golem. <laughs> Ow, he punched me. You know what, as well? The Manticore fight is technically, I would I would say, one of the very first uh, scripted boss fights. Because normally, like with the other ones, like the Dragon, Wyvern, and uh, Megapithecus. I understand, yes, the Overseer is definitely... I don't, I didn't have the pop-up. There we go. There we go. That's what I was waiting for, because that's what I was wondering. Like, oh, did it count? land boom boom also uh, I have not updated the drops for this map yet and I need to do that get the nice cinematic oh fire wyvern <laughs> launch me there's the nice red one I actually thought about naming that one uh Zuko, just because we do have the Azula one. But again, we're going to lose it here once we teleport. Like, every creature that we bring in is going to be Dunzo. I'm pretty sure. You know what? Actually, they might not. This isn't the Overseer. It's only the Overseer fight, I'm pretty sure. Nice cinematic of us leaving Scorched. I actually am not going to see this in the ASA yet, so. Only seeing it in ASE. Definitely not as laggy as last time. And here come, here we go to aberration, but technically we're going to the center. Okay. We're going to get the credits here. You continue to oh, impress we got this. Survivor. As you have grown in strength, I have been searching Helena's memories, finding what I have forgotten all these long years. Her friends and the journeys they had. Was it all for nothing? No. It had to be done. So that one day, you could exist. Together, you and I, we can put this right. You must travel onward, Survivor. For your greatest trials are still to come. Sorry, I left the cursor like right in the middle of the screen the whole time. Also, are there Bob's Tall Tales epilogues? There are! So, that's how I went from squeezing water from a cactus to fighting a Mandy Watsit in a ghost town. Wicked. Just goes to show, you gotta stay ready for the unexpected. And you always need to stick by the folks who have your back. Didn't you say you tamed the wits all by your lonesome? Well, I had some help. Oh, yeah. You still haven't told me where you met, you know, him. Oh, wouldn't you rather hear that story from the big guy himself? No way! Unlike you, he's got no sense of humor. <sighs> you just sit tight while your Uncle Bob thinks about how to tell this next part without giving nightmares. But I like scary stories! Hey, no, I was talking about it giving me nightmares. See, this is the point in our story. Things get dark. Real dark. Awesome. Oh. 
Is it just me or is this a better epilogue than the previous one? <laughs> that, honestly, that epilogue has to be the best. I love the Bob's Tall Tales. But you know what that also means? Uh, and this is most likely going to be for when I return. We're going to probably redo the over Overseer fight on the island. I know I definitely want to go tame a Giga. Uh, Tuso as well. I want to tame a Tuso. Um, I actually have never done a video on taming the Tuso. Back in Ark Survival Evolved, um, what I did there for the Tuso was I legit, I was just doing genetic library and I was crunching and crunching and crunching just because I wanted to get off the island because I was noticing like my island content was like starting to like drop. But I bet as well if I did the, you know, Tuso and like, you know, that would have probably gotten me some good views. Honestly, that would have probably got me some good views back then. Um, as well now, like <laughs> my original overseer fight in Ark survival evolved, uh, that one went pretty, pretty smooth. I know we had like one, we actually had one episode before it where it's like, I didn't even get everything into the cave and that's because I had Rexes and then I said, you know what, we're going to go theories, went back, redid it all with theories. And then this time in Ark survival ascended, I went in with Serratos. Well, now, Serratos and x Nautis, as of yesterday, was that, was that when that was announced? Yeah, uh, yesterday. Those two are coming to the base game of Ark, and I got a feeling that it might be all free Ark editions are coming, are coming to base game. Or who knows, they might even try and add the paid-for ones, but I highly doubt that. Like, extremely highly doubt that. But Ark Survival, as, like, Ark Survival Ascended... It's just, they keep on adding more and more creatures, and that's what I love. And then the modders, they're also adding so many creatures as well. It's, it's amazing. <laughs>